so we're leaving the park and we're gonna go visit Scotty Barker and his mom Flo over in Denham Springs which is only uh, a few miles away yeah so we're arriving at Scotty Scotty's place that's their old bar over there they got the gardens over here Michael's house built is built back there on the property to the left. Yeah. M is he working with So we just left Scotty's place in Denham Springs and had a good visit with Ian Mo and Michael's daughter. And it was a great little experience. Cindy hadn't met Flo Barker yet. Um, yeah, so it was a little bit. So it's the 11th and we're leaving the park again. We're going over to Ponchatoula. There is a, a shopping market over there. Ponchatoula, we're at the... Uh, Looks like the old, I guess this is the old train station, right, Sip? Uh, do you like Italian cookies? Uh, yes, if it's got almond in it. These are the, you don't mind these. No. These are the original floors from the oh, pre-Civil War era. It was burned down by the Yanks, and the town built back the uh, the facility, and been they've been selling here as a craft market since 1974. But Rather than the Yanks, you might want to refer to them as the Northern Aggressors. The Northern, that's <laughs> right. Okay, so we're uh, getting ready to eat lunch at the Millside Seafood House, seafood restaurant. It's all done in Canyon Groove Pine, and they have a cedar tree that uh, they used to hold up the center of okay, the so It's crazy. Here is the chicken and sausage gumbo steaming and a uh, side salad. Here is a small little dinner. It's fish and shrimp. Homemade onion rings that are to die for. And Cindy got a small basket of shrimp, which happens to be like 30 shrimp. Four dozen. Absolutely awesome. I haven't gotten into this yet, but the gumbo is awesome. 